timely app time tracking tutorial hi guys welcome back to the channel today i'm showing you how you can track your time with timely like a pro so let's get started what you have to do is just come to memory.ai slash timely and you will land on this beautiful looking website what you can do with timely is that you can actually track your time you can track your projects and track your team as well uh, timely is an amazing platform and i will show you how you can actually use it how you actually track your time how you can add tasks and uh, do a lot with timely so what i'm going to do is i'm going to use the free version but if you want to buy any plan so let me just show you the pricing real quick so you have an idea that when you will be buying timely how much you're going to pay so you can see the pricing right here uh, there is a starter which is for eight dollars per month and then there is a premium plan which is fourteen dollars per month and then there is unlimited plan which is twenty dollars per month and you also get an a custom plan where you can actually you know custom your features so you can see right here that all of these plans actually offer give you a free trial so that's pretty good and in the starter you get 50 projects but in most of the plans you will get unlimited projects so yeah go ahead before you know buying timely go ahead and try the free version and then you can just simply go ahead and use your timely so what you have to do is just sign up with your google account or your email address and you will land on this dashboard right here timely is super easy to use uh what happens on timely is that you see all of these different options right here on the left side of your screen and uh, then you will see the different options right here so if i want to add a new task what i have to do is just simply click on this new entry button and here i can add a note for this week's work for example let's just say um complete the tasks there you go then i'm going to select a project now my projects could be any project that i have already created for example it could be a general project or communication or uh, whatever project that you have created or you can actually you know create a new project of your own when you click on creating new project here we will be creating our new project so let me show you how you actually create a new project on timely so what you have to do is just add the project name uh let's just call it youtube video after that client uh you will add the client name if i want to add a new client or i already have a uh, existing client i will just simply add the information right here if i want to create a new client i will simply click on create new client and enter uh, their name and i can just simply create a new client just in a minute and then i can add their name or the name of any client that i want to i will select this client right here then if i want to add a set external id reference i can just check that too if i want to you know require any note while logging into the project i can and, uh, you know add as well this is just for the privacy purposes if you want to you know add you can just simply add it after that people and hourly rates now i can just add more than one people to my project if i want to add one person i can just have them if i want to add for example more people i can just you know simply add them right here and then all of the people that i add uh, will have access to the project now hourly rate i can just simply add hourly rate for each person now this is a great option that we get on timely what happens is that you are actually you know uh, getting an option where you can add rates of different people within a task for example a person is working for maybe five dollars per hour and the other person is working for ten dollars per hour so i can just have different time rates for them for each person and then they will be you know built accordingly so that's pretty good or if it's same for everyone i can just you know add same for everyone uh, maybe uh, five people working on the project and they all have the same budget for example they're all working for ten dollars uh, per Per hour so i will just simply add same for everyone and then add the hourly rate which is going to be 
ten dollars per hour you can actually change your currency as well so we'll scroll down if i want to add a budget for my project i can just simply you know click on enable budget so what's going to happen is that there is a budget that i have for this project for example let's just say i have a budget of hundred dollar now every person will have an idea that this is the budget for the project and this is the you know a uh, total bill that I, I will be getting for each project then there are tag option no tags user will not be able to tag their hours if there is all tag option that means users can tag their hours with any workspace tag uh, or then there is a select tag option where user can only tag their hours using certain tags so this is how tag work on timely uh, so once i have added all of the information you can actually you know change the color of your project as well so let's just give it a maybe a purple color so i have an idea after that just simply click on create project so now you will see that we were actually you know um going to uh, track the time so i showed you how you actually create a project because that's the first thing you will do we have created this project right here the purple one right uh, so you will see uh, that the actually the color has a role to play you will actually you know it will help you get organized you can just you know um remember the color of a project and you'll be like okay so this is the project that um maybe this is the youtube video project which is you know purple in color so once you have added your project what you have to do is if you want to log a time if it's a deadline if you have two hours if you have one hour uh you will simply add the time for example two hours or maybe if you do not have time limit you can just simply you know leave it and you can just track the time from the scratch after that uh you will see right here that i i have the option of from and two this means uh that i can add the time for example if it's two hours then they have added the time right here from like 11 to 1 a.m or maybe 10 a.m to 12 a.m so this is just the time after that plan option if i want to plan any time if i want to schedule a time i will simply add right here for example uh, i can just you know plan the time that maybe this is the plan time and this is like one hour after that if it's billable i will simply click on billable if it's non-billable then i will simply uncheck it so this is billable so i'm gonna you know keep it this way there is a more option if i want to move it to another date to schedule the task basically for example if i do not want to create it right now today i can just move it to another day to schedule it for another date super simple so once i have added all of this information i will simply click on submit and when i click on submit you will see that now my task has been added right here my entry has been added and now i will have an idea that this is a two you will actually see the billable hours right here that i added and if i want to you know hide anything i could just simply you know hide it right here if i want to copy any hours i will simply click on right here and i can just you know make copies of this task again if i want to add a new entry simply click right here select the project select the time and you can add your entry right here and then you can just track the time for your project so this is how uh, you can actually track time with the timely after that there is a task option uh, and in task option uh, you see all of your different tasks for example uh, you can have your board view you can have your list view and you can have your time sheets and you can actually have more than one task at a time you can have as many tasks as you want to which are actually you know divided into different dates as well then there is a project option where i will be able to see all of my projects that i we actually created one and if i want to create a new project Project, you simply click on new project and this is how we actually create it and then there is a people option where you see all of the people's all of the users that you have added you can check their activities how they are doing and uh, on what task each person is working how long they have been working on a task you can just check out right here from people then there is an option of reports and in reports you can just you know go ahead and check out the reports for your uh, different projects then there is invoice option where you can actually create invoices within timely this is amazing and you can just you know have an idea that these were the billable hours and then you can just create your invoices within timely you don't have to you know go ahead and use another um, platform for this simply click on new invoice and you will be able to add the project you add the date range you add the list items and then you simply click on create and your invoice is created
super easy right so yeah these are the basic features of timely a uh, very beginners friendly and uh, very professional as well uh once you are familiar with timely you can actually you know use it to manage your task and to time your track and uh, yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video i hope that i was a big help to you and now you will be able to track your time like a pro with timely make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel